Hey everybody, Mr. Alex here with a just-in-time, quick off-the-shelf review. This particular book is called I Can Code If Then. Yes, I know, it's weird. We already have children at this particular age level learning about coding concepts. Shh, don't tell anyone. That concept itself does not particularly thrill me. What does thrill me is that this book is not really just about coding. It's a book about consequences, which after all is what coding is about. So look at how this book does this. If I push this ball, then it rolls away. Well, that's a book that very clearly states actions have consequences. If I push the ball, then the ball rolls away. And if you look, you have the if-then statement stated here in coding language, and it explains to you that the if-then statement is also called a conditional statement, which builds upon the whole coding principle. But you know what? The book does more than that because a conditional statement is also a logical statement, which is a fundamental principle of standardized testing. So you're kind of getting a threefer in this book, which kind of freaked me out a little bit. I don't know if the publisher Actually, I am fairly sure the publisher, which is Sourcebooks, knew exactly what it was doing with this book. So you get a book that teaches very basic coding, the if-then conditional statement. You get a book that teaches logic, right? If something happens, then something else happens, which is the fundamental tenet of most standardized testing. And you get a, a book that teaches your child about consequences. If you do this, then something is going to happen, and that's going to follow you around for the rest of your life. Three very important principles that a child needs to learn, all disguised as a board book. I think that's plenty of bang for your buck, and that's plenty of bang for parenting. And after all, we know that the word parent is more than a noun, right? It's also a verb, and this is a book that's going to help you verb, or it's going to help you parent. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.